Yes, yeah, Stephen, as a matter of fact, six people were inside the home when the crash happened. Homeowners actually had family in town from out of state for Christmas, and they tell me they were all pretty much all gathered in the kitchen area, which isn't too far from this garage area. That's when a car came down the street, down the cul-de-sac, and into a window and into the brick that's in the garage area. The car actually went all the way through uh, the brick. Family members inside tell me the impact was so strong. Items in the kitchen, which butt up against the garage, slid across the room. No one inside the house was hurt. Westchester firefighters were able to get the driver, a woman, out of the car quickly, and she was taken to the hospital to be treated for unknown injuries. Investigators say it appears she had some sort of medical condition which caused her to crash into the house. But as bad as this looks, the homeowner tells me she feels blessed her family is okay. This can be fixed. This can be fixed. So we're good. Right. We're good there. That can all be repaired, fixed. Um, redone, but um, you know, we've got family and everybody's okay. And again, we're, we're really, really praying for the young lady um, and, and hoping that she's okay as well as her family as well. And you can see right now crews are up here boarding up the area where the crash happened. Family members were allowed inside to gather some of the belongings. I'm told an engineer will be out tomorrow to inspect the structure. Reporting live in Westchester tonight, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5.